the latest batch of San Diego election results are in, with several big races still too close to call. Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Carlo Chiquetto. Marcel is off tonight. Before tonight's data dump, there were still about 500,000 outstanding votes left to tally, and the Registrar of Voters is working to get them counted. That's where we find CBS 8's Richard Allen. Richard, what is the latest? Well, Carlo, just within the last minute, literally the latest results just came in. And I have to say what a difference a couple days make. We were here at the Registrar of Voters on Tuesday night when it was packed here, teeming with activity and raining. Now it's much more quiet, but I can tell you that there is a lot of work going on inside here. Now here is the latest of what we know from these most up to date numbers that we have. Now, of course, one of the most closely watched congressional races, which could play a part in determining the balance of power in the House, is that a 49th congressional district with incumbent Democrat Mike Levin facing off against Republican Brian Marriott. Now leading up to this latest data dump, Levin was in the lead by just over two percentage point. Now the latest numbers still reflect that. That is from the state results though. Orange County's results still have to be factored in, so that could change later on this evening. Now, another race, though, that's captured a lot of attention here locally in the South Bay is that of Chula Vista Mayor, with Republican Councilmember John McCann in the lead with 55% of the vote. Democratic challenger Amar Campanajar at almost 45%. Now, McCann's lead with these latest results has been solidified. Right now, McCann has almost 55%, Amar at 45% right now and of course one of the most controversial ballot measures this time around for the city of san diego is also one of the closest races if you will between yes and no votes now we're talking about measure b which would end no fee trash pickup for single family homes in san diego and instead start charging those households a fee essentially uh, making them pay now that's extremely contentious right now the no votes are winning on Measure B, 50.73% of the votes for no, 49.27% yes, extremely close between those two. Now, with and of course, these latest results still have to be tabulated. And if you want to see the latest results, you can also go to CBS8.com. Carlo? Yeah, so many different races around the county. You can definitely do that. Meantime, the registrar still has a lot of work ahead to count the outstanding ballots. Richard, any idea when we can expect the final results for all of these local races? Well, we can expect a couple more updates over the next couple days. And then the final results have to be certified. And this is at the California state level. Those final results have to be certified by December 8th, one month from Election Day. So at that point, we should have the final results. Carlo? Richard Allen from the San Diego Registrar's Office. Thanks, Richard.